Yesterday, we discovered two wild stallions that were having a Mustang standoff over two females. It turned into quite a story, and now we're back 24 hours later to tell you about Three's Company, Four's a Crowd, Part 2. Now, if you missed Part 1, you may want to go back and watch that first because it's a great story of drama that unfolds 24 hours before this. In part one, I had given them all names. The horse up on the hill, I called him Galahad because he was valiantly protecting his two girls. And this guy down below here, uh, he had nothing but patience. In, in part one, he just bided his time. He was in no hurry at all. And so I gave him the nickname Biden. But then afterwards, I realized, man, that's a horrible name to give a horse. So I want to give an apology to this guy. He's a good looking horse. So now I'm struggling. I can't think of a name for this guy. So uh, do me a favor and in the comments below, uh, think of a name for him. So now you can see that it's still going on from 24 hours ago. Nothing has changed. Galahad has his girls there, Daisy and May. It's obvious that he loves those two girls very much, but he just can't keep his attention on them because he's focused somewhere else. Rose is on binoculars in the command module, and so she, as I'm flying, she's watching uh, the uh, mystery horse as he's now just slowly creeping up the hill there. And uh, Galahad knows it, and so he's just keeping his eye out. Yep. Look at them. The sun's beginning to set. Look at those colors. There. Daisy's on the right, and there's May. She says, Hey, I want my camera time. <laughs> Uh-oh, uh-oh, somebody's getting a little too close. He says, I'll be right back. This guy. He's going to head back up with the girls. But man, what's got to be going through his mind? It's got to be stressing out there. He's just a young, a young guy. But he's going to stand his ground. This is drama in the wild. You're looking at it. Can you imagine doing this every day?
So Rose is telling me she's looking through binoculars that that uh, the creeper horse, he's already up, coming up again. He's just taking his time. He's in no hurry. He wasn't in a hurry yesterday. And now today is the same thing. So there you have it. That's Three's Company right there. So I'm just sitting ready here. I'm just let, letting the, the drone hover here. We're going to wait and see what happens. And I think in a minute here, something's going to go. This poor guy, he's got to be stressing out. Look at his back leg. He's ready to, ready to go. Can you imagine always being that tense? Yeah. Wished I could hear their vocalizations, but I don't have a microphone on the drone. Oh, look at the sun there. It's my favorite time of day to fly. It's just beautiful. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Hang on. <laughs> I love flying. Just drama unfolding right in front of us here. So he means it this time. He's headed down there. He's going to get him. Or not. Hmm. I think Galahad knows that he's got quite a quite a bit of competition. That other horse is pretty big. All right, I'm I'm just going to go back. So let's go look and see. Let's look at this horse. And yeah, leave a comment. Give this guy a name. I'm having a hard time. Look at that. Now he's just taking his time. And look at that. He's on his way back. Check out Galahad up there. This guy knows what he's doing. He's a good looking horse. So he's just taking his time and I know he's, he's trying to wear out that young horse. This guy's in no hurry. That's why he just keeps moseying up the hill. And then Galahad uses up all his energy. Look at that guy. He's a good looking horse. Yep, he's in no hurry. So again, now you know what wild horses do every day. What a life. Yep, he's, he's moving his way. He's inching up there a little. He's snaking his way up there is what he's doing. Just a little at a time.
Just a little bit farther. Little at a time. That is a good looking family. Look at them. It's amazing to see the drama unfold. Look at them. Beautiful sky and long shadows from the sunset. It's a pretty shot right there. And for now, he's a lucky guy, he is. Look at those girls. Mm -hmm. uh, but he, he can't keep his attention on him for long. Look at that pretty girl right there. Rose says the other stallion is moving closer. Just inching his way up, up the hill. It's a good looking horse here. Let's have a look at May. She's a pretty horse too. Look at that. Now wouldn't you know it, I'm getting a battery warning. Oh. All right, let's go, let's go. Let's hope we don't crash. All right, we're headed home, we're headed home. All right, I got a new battery and just in time. Here it goes again.
makes me wonder, are they just playing games? Is this what they do for entertainment? Heck, I don't know. that look at those two girls giving each other love nibbles look at that if I was Galahad I'd fall in love with them too look at that <laughs> right girls I'm home Well, hello, May. How are you? You're so pretty. The sun's dropping lower. It's just getting prettier and prettier. says he's on his way up the hill. He's pretty persistent. And look who made his way back up. <laughs> Hello, darling. Yeah, this is a Mustang standoff, that's what it is. All right, buddy. Let's get after it. <laughs> I can't believe I'm getting all this in one flight. Just, I'm just having fun. This could be it. Or not. Man, if that horse was me, I'd be needing a nap right now. <laughs> I don't know, this guy looks a little tired to me.
go. Get a good sniff. Get your courage up. He is a good looking horse. Just doing what wild stallions do in the wild. Look at those long shadows. It's beautiful. Intruders on his way back up again. As always, we'd like to thank you for watching. And be sure to subscribe if you haven't. This guy, he's pretty persistent. He knows what he wants. And he's just taking his time. Okay, it's time to leave. So we're going to leave it with this. And hopefully we'll see him again next time. And hopefully we'll see you again next time.